All right, ladies and gents. This tutorial will teach you how to create a new discipline using Woldle. First thing you need to do is go into your Vampire Masquerade Redemption folder and navigate to the Woldle directory. From here you go into scripts and what we need to do is go into the defines and we're going to create a new definition. We're going to create a whole new group. And I'm also going to show you how to create a nested definition in a subfolder. We're going to call this subfolder my dis. And we're going to go right in there. And we're going to create a new text file. And we're going to call this my dis. We're just going to open that up with Notepad. and we need to uh, define a discipline in our MyDisc group. And the first thing we do, um, the first, uh, first parameters we need to put in is we need to get the index in there and then separate it with a comma. Then we need to define the type. We're just going to call this a discipline. And then we need to define the name. I'm going to make a fireball discipline for my first for my first uh, discipline power. So I'm just going to call this my dis fireball and separate that. And then we need to define where the script is that is going to initiate initiate this effect. And the script we're going to put it in the vampires directory and we're going to call it my dis and the script we're going to call this how about my dis fireball and then the last parameter we need to put is the level requirement to access this discipline and it's only going to be level one and we can just save the file the next step is we need to actually uh, we need to make a string file matching the name of of the discipline we put in our definition file so it has to be called my dis fireball that what we called it so now i need to find it again okay there it is then we open it up and we put we put a description in there we'll just call it my discipline and each line has to be short, though. You gotta, you gotta make sure you don't uh, make the line. I'm gonna call it the fireball. <laughs> and shoots fireballs. This will appear um, in the game when you navigate to it. So you save that file. So now you got a definition, a string, essentially. <clears throat> now we need to go into the scripts commands and under vampires we need to create a new directory that we designated for the script um, I'm going to call it my dis or was it my dis was it? I'll double check that later on let's see here it's got a match that's, that's all that matters my dis Fireball, and then what we're going to do is we're gonna just going to make a basic fireball script in here. And to do that, we need to call it. We need to get it to activate on the cast event. So we just type in event cast, and we need to end event. So I'm just, I'm going to copy pasta here. So I'm feeling a little on the lazy side here. So I'm going to go on to the command references and find the projectile command. It's somewhere in here. There it is. I'm just going to take the first one. Copy it. I'm going to paste it. And this to fire a projectile at a target or target position. 
Um, we need to put in a template. I'm going to have it fire the standard fireball that's regularly available in the game, and I'm going to set its damage to eh, 30. Any type of damage input you put in here is going to be divided by 10 in, in the Wardle engine. Oh, and it's going to be fire damage if anyone gets hit. So it's going to do 3 fire damage. to those that are under the PMP rolls. So now we need to assign this to a character. So we go under scripts, characters, players, and I'm just going to create a copy of global here. And I'm going to name the file, the name I'm going to give to my character. I'm just going to call this tutorial. I'm going to open that up and I need to add a uh, a, def a define line define um, I'm going to define the discipline one um, discipline in the game and it's going to be assigned to my dis my dis and it's going to be at level one so this player is going to have the new discipline group at level one. Let me double check and make sure it matches. So I'm going to go under defines here. Okay, my dis with an S, my dis, and I'm going to go in here and double check here. We've got my dis, fireball, vampires, my dis, and you got to make sure that matches with uh, what we have under commands. So vampire my dis and it's not cap sensitive so don't worry about capitalization my dis fireball yep that should work my dis fireball okay so as long as it matches it should work so let's get out of here and I'm gonna double check the characters here and make sure okay so he's gonna be called tutorial he's gonna have our new discipline that we just defined and it's going to be at level one. All right, let's see what that looks like. All right, I'm going to go into multiplayer now. LAN. And let me create a new character here for. I'm going to call him Tutorial. Has to match the name of the player file that I created. So great tutorial. Okay, so now we just create game. It's gonna go into. It's gonna go into the dark ages in. Okay, first thing I have to do is I need to go into storyteller mode and click on revive. I am back. And let the system activate. So, there we go. We got Discipline 1 that's been defined. It should be defined with our uh, our new group. So when I select the Discipline and cast it in there, there we go. We see our string. The fireball shoots fireballs. So when we go to cast it, to cast it, should create fireballs. So there you go. That's how you create Disciplines and Wodle. Have fun. Signing out.